Nichols. Now, you were a member of the Miracle on Manchester team in 1982. And wanted to ask you if there was one characteristic of that team that you would like implemented on this year's LA Kings, what would that be? Well, I think if you think back, uh, we were underdogs the whole way. You know, uh, Edmonton had such a great team. I think they went on to win two or three Stanley Cups after that. But just we never quit. Even when we were down 5 nothing, uh, we just battled back and, uh, and won the game. So I think any team, uh, you know, all you'd want – uh, out of their team is just a no-quit attitude and uh, each guy do what what they're meant to do don't do someone else's job do your own job and uh, if you do that well then you got a good chance to win well I'll talk about someone who knows about doing their job they're supposed to do you are one of eight players in NHL history with 70 goals and one of five players in NHL history with over 150 points for the season so what do you think about uh, the league how it is now do you think you would be able to put up those kind of numbers in today's league well uh, I always thought you could I think uh, there's so many more power plays now uh, more five on threes uh, we never had that when when I played and uh, oh we had obviously had power plays but I mean uh, you get you know two or three five on threes a game sometimes and I'd go a whole season we maybe have two or three in the whole season so uh, I think the opportunities there, there's no red line that creates a little bit more offense. So, you know, it's surprising to me that there's not more 50, 60 goal, goal scorers in the league. So uh, I, I think with today's game, it's faster. Uh, there's a good chance that you'll see someone do real well again. Good. Well, uh, one question I wanted to ask you, a little fun fun note. People may not know that you've actually played golf with Tiger Woods before and you beat him. <laughs> Tell us about that fabulous day in history for you yeah I sure did uh, and it's it's funny uh, we were playing down at Big Canyon a good friend of ours John Hamilton uh, is a member there and uh, there was Jimmy Fox and Mark Hardy and I were playing and we we're playing against uh, five guys from the Angels and uh, there was only four of us and, and John Hamilton said uh, do you know who you're hitting balls against or beside in the driving range I said no he said that was Tiger Woods and I went you gotta be kidding me I said why don't you ask me if you want to play you know uh He's a sports fan. He may want to play. Sure enough, I see him come with his golf bag, and he jumps in my cart, and we play. And uh, I think he shot 74. I shot 72. So my claim to fame is Tiger Woods has never beaten me at golf. <laughs> <laughs> and not many people can say that. So I don't know if he wants a rematch or not, but if he does, you know, maybe I'll let him play me. Yeah, very few people in the world, in fact, can say that. <laughs> That's right. That played against him. You know, obviously, if you never played against him, he's never beaten you. But for the people that have played golf with him or against him, not many he's never beaten. Well, good. Well, thanks so much for your time today. We appreciate it. And. Uh... <laughs>